Meantime, we are just now learning about Chicago's plans to manage traffic during the NASCAR street race that's going to take place this July. Dane Placco is live and he has details. And good afternoon, Dane. What do we know? Good afternoon, Roseanne. Yeah, the city today essentially laying out its game plan for how the race will impact streets and traffic in downtown Chicago. And it includes shutting down some of the city's busiest and most important roadways. Now, the NASCAR race is scheduled to take place in and around Grant Park on the weekend of July 1st and 2nd. But according to a briefing this morning, it'll start having an impact on traffic and parking as early as June 2nd. On that day, parking restrictions will go into effect along Columbus Drive between Jackson and Balbo. Then on June 10th, Ida B. Wells will close east of Michigan Avenue so that construction can start on viewing stands. Now the most significant closures start on June 25th when Columbus Drive between Jackson and Roosevelt will be shut down. Then on the 28th, southbound to Savile Lakeshore Drive will be closed from Randolph to McFetridge just north of Soldier Field. And the next day, Roosevelt Road will be closed east of Columbus as will northbound Michigan Avenue between Balbo and Jackson. Jackson. One day later, all of Michigan Avenue will be shut down between Balbo and Jackson. Now, during race weekend, northbound Lakeshore Drive will also close between McFetridge and Randolph. And during today's briefing, city officials said there will be plenty of signage warnings of closures, pointing out detours, and they say all the businesses in the area should be able to remain open, although it is clear you'll have to walk quite a few blocks to get to many of them. So, when will all this be over and when will things open up? They say uh, in the early morning hours of July 3rd, Monday, July 3rd, the day after the race, some of the major streets will be reopened, but it'll be July 15th before this area down here is restored to the way it looks right now. Uh, there will be a website going online tomorrow to uh, offer more specific information to people who live and work in the area. And there will also be a public hearing uh, coming up later this month from uh, the alderman's office to discuss impacts of uh, these race closures. Live downtown, Dane Placco, Fox 32 Chicago. Roseanne, back to you. So while those race cars are flying, the rest of us may just be sitting in traffic, huh, Dane? <laughs> We're going to be sitting in a lot of traffic. Yeah, when you, well, when you see Lakeshore Drive being shut down, Michigan Avenue being shut down, uh, some of these important streets, Columbus, it, it, it is really going to be a mess. That's yeah. big. All right, Dane, thank you.